I do miss throwing the Pokeball in RCS. Yes! I really like that. But I I ah! want the battling from this Pokemon. I don't yes, want the RCS battling. battling. Is amazing. You know what? You know what? They every every I game. With that, that, though, and I'll tell you why. Every version that they've made, the evil team has just gotten more and more and more pathetic. That's true. Too. <laughs> I, I I want. Like an actual, I want to like fear. For, is, is this world really going to end? I want to fight the mafia again. <laughs> yes, <laughs> give me the yeah. mob. You're yeah, yeah. I it's no, true. I no, I want, I want the uh, what was the yeah. I, Black I and white, like, I think, is the last really good team plasma because they're like they we were, want that was, no one to have Pokemon. That was like, fascinating. That was, I that was a they really. A, they were like oh, and they're they like we're Pokemon point. liberation thing. And then the one guy's like, "No, I'm the only one that wants Pokemon." Yeah. And you're like, well, "Ah, yeah." No. Kind of a kind of a cop out, right? I, really, I want to say this about Arceus's battle system real quick. I disagree with you. I enjoy that battle system about a thousand times more, and I'm going to give you three reasons why. One, it's way faster. Two, the Pokemon actually make contact with each other. Why did they go back on? I like that, that with the art. Ridiculous. Yeah, I agree that. Three. The quick and strong system is the most clever, inventive remix to the Pokemon battle formula they have ever had. But it's mega, not as cool. Mega, mega evolution. Toss it. Cool nope. Toss it in the trash. Nope. Disagree. Gigantamax. Slow. In the trash. Mega evolution. Slow. Pointless. In the trash. Terrestrializing. A little faster. A little more interesting because you're mixing up the types and it goes quicker. But quick and strong always made it a guessing game. You never knew what you were going to do. And I love the idea that my Pokemon, if I play it just right, can give me a one-two punch, and then it's done faster, which, again, is the ultimate supreme end goal of all Pokemon design. Faster. Anytime something gets faster in Pokemon, fans cheer. And in this you, game, you they're like, let's Pokemon. slow it down a little bit more. You picked Twinkle, really right? Did. You both did? I did. You guys picked the slowest Pokemon. starter. Yeah. <laughs> He steamrolled every gym I took him He's to. Good. It was yeah. laughable. Yeah. They're like, hey, bug type fire. A grass type fire. <laughs> maybe maybe this type ghost. Maybe a psychic ghost. No, oh, ice. Ice yeah. fire. Ice <laughs> fire. What about the water gym? Okay, all right. The one. <laughs> yeah, the, the one. The, uh, guess what? I can feed him terror crystals and get. Oh, but I grass. brought out my beautiful <laughs> pillow watcher and I showed my son like Kofu the, the, the meaning of the mind. <laughs> Dude, uh, annihilate! I like annihilate. Oh, I picked, awesome. I picked the uh, the duck, the duck, uh, the Quaxquaval. I named him oh, yeah. after a JRPG character. Any guesses? You gotta be, you gotta narrow it down a little bit. Which, which dragon, why? Dragon uh, Quest. It's in the Dragon Quest franchise. And why did you name him for this particular character? <sighs> okay, did you name him Silvando? Silvando? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> okay. yeah. Because they're both very, very carnival, very festive. Yeah, very carnival. All the dancing, you know, the, the like oh, that yeah. flamboyant. The gesture, dinner, like, flamboyant. He is quality. Silvando. I was like, yeah, done. And he's just oh, there, you know. Silvano and like, and Paldea, Spain, Silvando's mm -hmm. like the Spanish. It accent. all fit. I was like, done. Um, he's cool. Up. I think you guys got the cooler starter. Yeah. So I, you brought up an outlet, but I wanted to say I feel yeah. like this game is just just bravo to fighting types. It yeah. just yeah. nailed fighting. Hit so many great fighting type Pokemon. Mm -hmm. I love. Mm -hmm. how, how do you, how do you feel about the the generational mouse elect electric mouse? Oh yeah, the little guy fighting. and he gets electric fighting. He's really good. Yeah. He's yeah. yeah. He threw me he's for a loop. I, I saw some Pommy. interesting. Yeah, Pommy, Pomo, Pomot, Pomot. Yeah. I didn't Eric really has a shiny that. one. You guys are shiny. Are you still shiny hunting? The cat's cool. Oh, My son it, picked the cat. Yeah. Uh, Chetzale. 99 the cat he is red um he, he has a move that never misses and it crits every time you're like oh okay Fancy. and he's yeah. the fastest he's great yeah it's not, i've heard it's yeah. like a glass cannon type you bring him out you hope to God you one shot yeah people were kind of upset with their final design but as a actual pokemon not they're bad. very effective they're good honestly and, oh they're good i'm not put off by the, the like typically bipedal is a thumbs down for me but but it was unique enough that i was like yeah. okay that's a little more in the blaziken and yeah. less in the like Bruxish or whatever that one is he, called. He is Spanish Blaziken, full on. Like it, he has a super kick. You're like, oh, okay. yeah. I'm, this yeah. is this is Water Blaziken. Well, Meowskarada, not Meowskarada. I mean, I, oh, Meowskarada. That's kind of like right. Delphox a little bit too. A little know? bit, but yeah, I, I, I thought it was just fantastical enough and a little less. Like yeah. Incineroar is just straight up like, what if a wrestler was a furry? I'm like, okay, but that's not yeah. a. You mean my favorite? But that's not. Yeah, but it's not a Pokemon anymore. It's like as soon as it crosses the line, my favorite. 
Pokemon? It's a person. That's that's a person. It shouldn't be in a Pokeball. It makes me uncomfortable. Favorite right yeah. here. This is a gift from Rillaboom. Big fan of him, Look. too. That's um, okay. Like... A primate, right? But yeah. I see Incineroar walking on two legs with a wrestling belt, and I'm like, you're, in a costume, you're not an man. animal. You're a, you're a man. <laughs> you're a man. You're Hello Kitty. is a man. You're Hello Kitty. Yes. Hello Kitty is actually a human. woman in a costume, right? That's the Exactly. A, hu a human. A, no, a not human. a costume. It's Stuart Little style. I don't know if you guys are familiar. Stuart Little is not actually a rat. He is a human boy that was born a few inches tall and looks exactly like a rat, but is not one. No. Look what? it up. Look it up. And not talking about the movie. Is that what they the say book. to him? Because they're like, hey, you're you're different. And they just want nope. him to think he's a real Look boy. It up. So he, Look it up. It's hey, one of hey, those weird... On the, they're it's playing one them. of those weird, like, proto... This was before they had a language for these type of like, oh. furry mascot characters. And so they were just like, it's Got a it. human boy who looks like... The missing link. Yeah. But I mean that literally. I'm not, like... Yeah. I'm not interpolating for you. I'm like, check the Wikipedia. He is a human boy born that small who looks like a rat. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs>